everyone. We are here today to tell you some of my personal goals in the game and I'm gonna explain to you why you should have personal goals in this game um, and my opinion in uh, what I suggest to you and how you could progress through World Boss Legend 1 now and the 5 best team works for me and why I was trying all this time and now finally I'm done doing something specific for me and in uh, extent could be for you also and makes you feel better but before we go through that we're gonna see the last sneak peek here uh, we took for Mubaku and it's a character that it's already in legendary battle of a uh, black panther but you couldn't play as him and as it seems he's getting a new uniform uh, feels you know more shiny than the legendary battle at least and we're gonna be able to play with him so i'm not sure what uh, type he's gonna be feels like speed villain or again combat uh, i'm not sure i'm not sure so yeah let's go to the theme of the video and before we go to the main theme oh i want you to re i want to remind you uh, the way you could support and help this channel get boosted through the youtube algorithm which is smash the like button subscribe to the channel and yes comment down below in the comments what's your five clears you're doing the main dps you know what you're using for five clears on null and of course what stages you're playing and that was my the goal i had into this game you know when we transition from world boss ultimate to world boss legend i was like Oh my god, I'm gonna get less than mythic boxes, just, you know, uh, my luck gonna be worse, I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna get the same rewards and stuff like that. And after the tier 4 introduced into the game, I tried to push the stages I'm farming and farm more than stage 50 five times for every legendary, every world boss legend. I've success at the moment for Mephisto and Null. And we are here to introduce you the five tips I cleared for stage 50 and above. And the f I'm gonna show you the teams and what the build looks like and the effort, you know. I'm gonna show you how much in total time it's taking me to do this. And starting from the team with Storm. My Storm got CDP of Raids, a mediocre build. It's not like super duper built it, as you can see. Uh, she's not uh, tier 4 or something, tier 3, level 80, latest uniform and the CTP of raids goes here for world boss legend also that's gonna be the first team I'm gonna showcase uh, the second team I think it's on level 60 uh, and it's the team with my latest tier 4 which is Garnet and this team up it's with Agent Venom in the team up and his own artifact also uh, my Karnat's got a really decent build. I'm using him for ABL, ABX uh, every time I could. And again, CTP of Raid, not Mythic Uniform. Um, his uh, maximum, basically, his physical attack looks like 63,000. Uh, the second team I'm gonna showcase is Hulk team with PvP build, of course, and uh, I'm using him for a Lions tournament. This week we succeed to a Lions tournament also. So here is the two tier force, but one is PvP, the other is pure PV. I love Carnage, that's why I want to show you what I'm able to do over and over again. As you can see here, it's a, pr it's a clear PvP build and the uh, the fourth team i'm gonna showcase it's the team of black widow i'm using black widow here with sea hulk leadership wave support and he's here with the city of raids which is bad i mean i was doing really faster with mighty energy and mighty destruction previously but i swapped to raids for abx and abl in case i was doing here tier 4 i didn't perhaps i'm gonna swap but i'm gonna show you the run either way uh, with the raids, what she's able to pull out, uh, that's her build also, and the last one is the one I'm progressing, this is not far mode, and it's for stage 66, uh, I did the other day, 
yes, stage 66, and you don't have the options to use a lot of characters, it's only Thor or Black Bolt, and because there is this team up with uh, Thor, and Thor is easier to use, at least for me, for um, Black Bolt, Black Bolt is a new character, he is able to do state 65 really easy, I haven't tested him 66 or 67, but Thor clearly doing it, as you can see, I'm progress through these stages with him and not tier 4, and that's why uh, one of the main reasons I'm not starting to tier 4 him already, you know, I don't have the material cells, so, but I would be sure for him, because he's really good, he's one of the best tier 4, but at the moment, as a tier 3, level 80 serves me really well. I'm using him with the raids also, just for ABL. With the judgment, he was pretty much the same in World Boss Legend. It was kind of better, because as you can see in the, in the things I'm gonna show you, it's uh, in the clips I'm gonna show you basically, uh, he is lacking the rage proc sometimes, sometimes not. But before we go the actual runs, I want you to remind you my Discord server, and the reason is that Alaska Light, the member and moderator of the channel, the premium guy here, uh, is really did another miracle. He just did a bot for every single tier for uh, dropping his name there and seeing his value in all all over the game. Let me show you. That's the bot name, it's Little Alaska as you can see, and as you're typing uh, slash Thor or slash whatever tier 4 you want, you're getting 4 Thor with a ranking, you know, 9 out of 10, his name, what's the tags he's using, and the best CTP for him, and what's the second option, what's the first option, the ISO sets, uniforms, artifacts, and also a list of world boss legends that you could utilize him, how much days he could participate in ABX and ABL into uh, the 14 days um, rotation, and you know, you're getting uh, information for every single character, here is Venom also, as you can see, he made the icons, he made everything, of course, I assist him and help him uh, for with the information and all this stuff, and it's something new, shiny that you could utilize and see what's the best for you to build let's go to the actual gameplay let's start with our girl storm as i told you and it stage 50 and that's zoom for no reason i didn't want that okay okay yeah, that stage 50 with here. Um, I, I'm gonna talk about here a bit. I mean, here rotation, it's pretty straightforward. You're starting with your third skill. Wait a bit after two cancel one, uh, five delay cancel four. And you want to proc on the fourth skill. If you have your tier three ready, you're dropping it. Of course, I'm not telling you to wait until uh, Storm gonna be able again to to participate to take here and use here. If you already have here, I'm just showing you how I utilize here as a tier three level 80 and how easy it is to farm world boss with here. Now at least. And yes, uh, I know that uh, most of the people, you know, it's on a rush. They don't want to spend more time than doing stage one and that the, the rewards actually stage 20 let's say stage 20 to stage 50 it's pretty much the same stage 50 of course perhaps have some more carbonadium some more uh soul of faulting basically soul faulting is from gbr yeah the life seeds uh but yes i mean the chance to get the box the chest that drops ctp or p card it's really huge uh it's really something basically and yes, I know it's something inside me that's pushing me to push more. Uh, the World Boss Legend people are just doing fast stage 1 or stage 2. But it's the way I'm, I'm doing it. I want to be competitive every single day, you know, do the, the maximum for my account, collect maximum rewards, collect maximum RNG. Even if you don't get the chest, you know that you spend some RNG and perhaps the very next time you're luckier with that. So yes, here as you can see, I'm only 2 minutes into the stage, stage 50, 
and I've already done uh, the that of a progress it's I'm in the last phase and no tier 4 needed right uh, perhaps I used two tier 4s but the reason is that people are saying you know okay i don't want to do to invest all these tier fours i don't i don't need the tier fours i don't have the materials but you know what the game it, it's actually not saying you to tier four any character as you're gonna see in the end i was able to do uh with thor with 33 seconds left the state the very high the highest stage i could use him which is stage 67, 66 of now, without needed the tier 4. So only if you're progressing through your account for level 80s, you're, and you get the latest uniforms, of course, just, just level 80 helps a lot, and also the latest uniforms most of the times really do all the work. I mean, tier 4s, yes, the update is huge and the characters getting huge bump, but even without tier 4s, you're able to do stage 50 and to move. And it, with that way, you're increasing your conqueror level, with that way, you're getting more rewards through the world boss legend, um, you know, roadblocks there are for chesses and for uh, CTP chests, of course. And that's how I want to feel, you know, I want to think on the game, the, the progress, the progress, um, how it's called, the progress part of the game. I really enjoy that and I really enjoy doing every single time higher and higher stages, trying to go in the very last stage, you know, and you can see here Carnage was able to do into five, 55 seconds. Uh, stage 60, easy peasy, of course I'm losing some procs, I'm doing some chimichangas here in the rotations, but as you can see, I mean, 10 seconds for the very next phase, 15 seconds, 10 to 50 seconds for a whole 10 bar, 8 bars, it's really something. This boy makes me proud every single time, and even if he don't have the huge amount of damage sometimes, uh, when he gets the accumulation, he's doing miracles. You're doing the, you're seeing the bars melting, and I want to showcase the value of Carnage sometimes, uh, which is from zero to hero. Uh, basically, he's not zero and at all. He can do really decent damage, but if he manages to accumulate, he's doing miracles, bro. He is out of your mind, good. I really enjoy playing with him. And the reason, uh, and another reason, it's the un uniqueness of this character into his tier 4. His tier 4 is lifesteal and the, the, the hugest lifesteal I've ever seen. I'm stage 60, I, I, I'm taking like 60% of my HP on every single hit and using the tier 4 here makes me can do whatever I want into this makes me can do whatever I want into the very last phase so it's really cool and you see there I did it really fast it's faster than Hulk I think and I'm using Hulk mainly because you don't really need to pay attention to be honest I mean I have a PvP build he's so tough even if I get hit it multiple times the damage doesn't touch you and his damage, if you manage to, um, you know, synchronize his tier 3, his tier 4 and the 4th skill makes really huge attacks. As you can see here, I'm doing it and you can look, look at that 4th skill. Okay, I get myself into the cleaner cage, but this 4th skill sometimes seems to do a lot of damage. I really enjoy playing with him and the fact that I can use him double deep, it's the reason I put him into the top 10 first list. You can see here, he did it in the same time with Carnage and I'm doing sloppy rotations, I'm playing chilling and playing basically and you can see here spamming again. Uh, my fourth skill, I, I want to use my tier 3 before I use my fourth skill there. I did delay uh, the value of my tier 4, but still, look at this. It's 6 bar instead of 8, but the good part is, look at that. He gonna split, spit on me the, the black things, 
and I'm gonna take them and there is no problem. Look at this. He touched me and did less than 10% of my HP and this used to one-shot my characters. That's a, that's one of the main reasons I'm using Hulk. I really enjoy him. And yeah, tier 4 Hulk's mass bro with a PvP build. Yeah, think about having a mighty destruction and doing proper rotations, not this chimichangas I'm doing. Or a CTP of raids and do pretty much similar rotation. He gonna skyrocket his damage, uh, but there is no reason for you using him only for PvP or only for PvE. If you just use a PvP build, you can do that in PvE. I mean, it's not stage 84, perhaps. He can participate in stage 85 of uh, Null, as you can find out in my Discord server. Uh, but in this stage, yes, perhaps he gonna need a PvE build. But for this kind of stages, which is the the first small uh, pillow for me, you know, doing stage 50 and above into World Boss Legend. I'm gonna chill now, I'm not gonna over -ass it, I'm doing what I want into Null and Mephisto. And the, the very next roadblock for me, it's stage 49 of Ultron, which is really hard to do with uh, Storm. Uh, as tier 3 level 80 and perhaps I need to do tier 4 him or something like that. I need to figure out about that. And for Gore, I'm not there yet. I'm progressing stage 39. So I have some, you know, some time for doing 5 out of 5 mythic test uh, casing on uh, Gore and Ultron. My girl Black Window, it's kind of kind of off because I'm using the CTP of Rage as I told you previously. Don't get me wrong, she's not bad at all, but with an energy, her rotations really feels way better in my mind and in my brain. And I've done video for her uh, with a mighty energy in the past. You can go through the channel and find it. Uh, but that's her value with the raids and with this specific build you can use here for ABL, you can use here for ABX. Of course there are better characters like Makari, like uh, Kamala Khan. But I'm just showing, showing you here what I'm doing and how i taking advantage of here. There are others of course you could use in the same place Kamala or you could use a Blue Dragon. Uh, but I wanted to put uh, Black Widow because people was saying that Black Widow is bad as a tier 3, she got no damage, she got no survivability. But as you can see here, she's kind of slower than the uh, Carnage and Hulk, uh, even 5 stages less. Uh, but she is a tier 3 and these two dudes was tier 4 as you saw there. Uh, yes, you can see here, you're not, there's no period of time that you could get a lot of damage because she's dodging a lot. Here, art, I have here artifact also, of course, but he got so guarding dodge and dodge that she could dodge herself without extra tier 4 or artifact. Uh, you can see here, there's no period of time I'm taking any damage, even if he's, he's slapping me, slamming with uh, his sword. I'm not getting nothing. You can see the word dodge jumping around there. And here, yes. Uh, I, I can't remember how much, how fast I did it. But you can see the good part with here is that you could do actually whatever you want with your rotation and it's gonna work. I'm pretty much doing four cancel five, delay cancel into three. And if I have my tier three, uh, the same thing, but dropping a tier 3, delaying cancelling into a third skill. Uh, in between the fifth skill and the third skill, actually. As you can see here, I'm staying a bit into the tier 3, just to avoid him for hitting me. So it's not all the time what the... Uh, look at this, I could die here, but I dodged so many hits from this purple bubble there. She's actually really cool. And Seahawk there. I have tier 3 Seahawk. I need to make a showcase for her also. I haven't done it yet. I own you that. I need to do it. But that's for 
um, another video in the future, of course. And here uh, I was out of range and I was like, oh my, oh my god, what I'm doing here? I wanted to showcase how fast I'm doing it. Look at this, I survived it, right? I survived it. I swapped there just to save myself uh, because actually I could push it into the last phase. I didn't have the right, uh, I was far from the, from now, that's why I didn't. So here, yes, I'm not gonna risk it because yes, she's dodging, but not that much. I mean, this attack here kills everyone, guys. Me previously standing still inside with Hulk and Carnage was like uh, something crazy. Uh, when Null came into here, I did the same thing with the raids, with uh, the range of the character. Yes, not raids, range basically. And uh, here you can see how softly she can do it, even if I'm just spamming some skills here and there. You don't really need to try a lot. CTP of Raids feels really easy peasy here. And I'm showing you the rewards just to compare them also. You know, I'm I'm dropping all the rewards here. I'm not gonna count them because if I count them, I need to compare them with someone doing less stage. And I'm not gonna do less than this stage, at least for now. So if you want to compare them yourself, you know, Legend 1, Stage 1, with Legend 1, Stage 50. What's the difference if you're playing Stage 1? You can compare them by yourself. I'm showing all the rewards for that reason. I don't want to, you know, I don't want to push you doing it uh, for yourself, you know, trying to progress through the World Boss Legend and being able to have chance for Mythic Chess. Uh, and I just want to to give you the information how much how much uh, rewards I'm getting and what's the chances uh, on all these five runs I didn't get any book I didn't get any chest uh, so it's just rewards to compare there and I had um, a, a hope in my mind that I'm gonna get my final universal book because I'm lacking the universal books to showcase proper Morgan Le Fay. And yes, that's why I'm delaying here with you at the moment. I have only nine and I start uh, collecting them and grinding them when I did tier three uh, Black Bolt, I had skipped him. And I did him as soon as, soon as I was uh, aware of his new uniform. Uh, day one and now after a couple of days I'm able to say I have complete I have nine books uh, for all you folks out there saying in my comments that you that you believe that the drops of the books are low yes they are uh, you need more than 10 days to farm them for sure I've seen people in my alliance chat saying that they are farming over and over again for like one month when Kamala came into the game, uh, she came with Hulk, I think, or something like that, or Titania, and people had already used the books, so people was struggling for Kamala, and yes, the struggle is real, books are dropping really low, but as you can see, I am kind of free to play on that, uh, I'm not gonna buy anything to get faster books, I'm gonna wait myself like everyone do uh, the period of time needed for Morgan Le Fay. So yes, you can see here Thor has the less damage than the others because he's just, he's actually progressing through my account here. And I'm using, I'm using weird rotations just to avoid dying. It's not like uh, the rotations I'm using with the city of Rage is the most efficient, but it's working pretty nice saving yourself and also do a lot of damage. The second skill, it's a really good utility tool uh, that you can run around into the stage. And here, uh, yeah, I had the proc on the tier three exactly on my face there. So yes, now is dropping the slimes. I have to I'm doing the clock thing every single time I need to play, you know, proper and avoid the clock thing is the smartest way. And the smartest way is also to swap character when Null is jumping because whatever you do, 
perhaps he bugs and came into your face. Um, here I tried to avoid it and I did avoid it. Uh, I'm already stayed at bar 14. I want to push him into the dragon face here. I'm not actually... I can't really avoid the dragon face here. And you can see it's 1 minute and 30 seconds. That's the time, uh, the minimum time you you could have and be able to clear the last phase with 10 bars. If I had like uh, 13 bars could be harder, but with 10 bars it's actually easier. I use my tier 3 here because I don't feel comfortable waiting uh, to to keep the tier 3 you know and utilize it when i when this when the stage is gonna start so i believe in my thor i believe i have the damage so i'm gonna start without the tier 3 i'm gonna use it into the very next rotation into the the first rotation i'm gonna do uh, the just the normal one without the tier 3 i'm starting with the fifth skill here until he drops down i canceling into the third skill and after the fourth skill that helps you and gives some time to my CTP of raids getting up. And after you can see I'm cancelling 5 into 4 and into my tier 3. Doesn't really matter. 30 seconds left. So that means I can do stage 67 for sure and I can keep progressing with him. So that was it guys. Don't forget to mention down below into the comments what you are doing for five null days and as you can see now i'm able to farm state 67 thank you for being here thank you for your time see you into the next bye bye to everyone